It's the late 1970s, and Francis and Hazel are first-time parents and recent immigrants to Canada. But their one-year-old baby boy is sick, and the doctors don't know what to do. Their son has a high-grade, continuous fever with swollen lymph glands in his neck and no other symptoms. The doctors think it could be meningitis, but the treatments are ineffective. For weeks, the baby's fever continues to rage. The doctors are baffled and are unable to help. At this point, can you imagine what Francis and Hazel must be going through? How would you feel? One day, something changes. The skin on the baby's hands and feet start to peel off like rubber glove. The insides of his mouth start to rip apart like twisted, rusted metal. His lips and his tongue turn as red as a strawberry. For the doctors, these are important clues. They had just attended a medical conference where they had heard about the exact same symptoms. At the conference, a speaker discussed a rare new children's illness called Kawasaki disease. It causes inflammation in blood vessels, which can result in fatal aneurysms in the heart or coronary arteries. The doctors remember what they had heard and quickly administer a new treatment on the baby. Francis and Hazel are incredibly lucky. Their baby <laughs> will survive. It's the late 70s and the first known survivor of Kawasaki disease in Canada is me. Today, no one knows what actually causes Kawasaki disease, though it's the leading cause of acquired heart disorders in children. But over 30 years ago, someone spoke at a conference. They shared their experience in the symptoms and the treatments, and this saved my life. My doctors, my parents, and this speaker saved my life. This is the biggest reason why I speak and why I help others give presentations that get results. And I can help you too. If you're an expert, an employee, or an entrepreneur, you too can impact lives. Your message can make others think, feel, and act differently. Your stories can reflect the emotions and experiences of your audience. If they can see themselves in your story or begin to identify with what happens next, they will begin to care. Stories can immediately transform facts and knowledge into something more personal and meaningful for your audience. All great superheroes have an origin story. And all great leaders can present a possibility using a story. What's your story?